Hi, my name is Trevor Renwick. I'm Fine Arts Chair at Heron High School. Why did you come out tonight? Um, I came out just, I'm interested in education generally and more specifically progressive initiatives um, to get us where we need to go. Obviously, there are a lot of good things going on in education, however, there is a lot of room for improvement. So um, I was interested into hearing what the fellows uh, were working with and trying to really kind of steal some ideas if I can here, make some partnerships and just try to learn something tonight. What, what ideas did you learn about that you might steal? Um, well, ironically enough, um, I used to teach in the South Bronx and in Chicago, and prior to coming, I must admit I didn't do my research, um, and I did not know that Dr. Bitts um, was here and was actually working with a comic book project. And in Chicago, we impl I implemented a comic book project through a program called After School Matters, so it was nice to talk to him see what he, um, so answer some questions I had about it, and then more importantly, how that related to his new project. I'm Greg Ferrybach, and I'm an attorney. And is there any, are you interested, are you passionate about education, or I'm, what was the reason for coming out? I'm extremely passionate about education. My wife and I are here tonight, and uh, it's uh, pretty much our, our avocation and vocation. Uh, so we've done a lot of educational opportunities, and uh, have a lot of other career opportunities that we're heading in that direction. So, Are you going to take anything from tonight? Are you going to do anything that, with what you've learned tonight? Well, it's interesting. Uh, one of the fellows talked about uh, the gapping program, and we have a son who's a junior, and I'm not so certain that we might not go back and uh, evaluate what uh, the gap year is like and see maybe if uh, one of our students uh, doesn't fit into that gap. Great. Thank you. My name is Carlton Ray. I'm the president of the Indianapolis Monumental Marathon. Okay. Uh, we're um, a new marathon that started last year. We had um, 3,500 runners from 43 states and seven countries. But the goal for us is, uh, besides putting on a great race, is to raise funds for IPS-related charities. And one of the charities that we funded last year and plan to support this year and in the future is Mind Trust. I'm going to announce uh, a uh, donation next week um, to Mind Trust. And uh, hopefully as uh, time progresses, um, we'll, we'll grow it. It's all across the, all across the um, spectrum of, of runners and walkers, uh, we also have a sense that uh, education is valuable and needed and, and that uh, Mind Trust provides a great opportunity for improving education and um, getting folks prepared for, um, for what the uh, 21st, 22nd century has to, to, has to offer. And how can people learn more about to get involved with your marathon? Uh, they go to monumentalmarathon.com um, or the Indianapolis, or just Google Indianapolis Monumental Marathon. And, when uh, is it? Uh, November 7, 2009. Okay. Uh, it starts and finishes down the State Capitol Building and the uh, Expos in the uh, uh, Convention Center. Great. Thank you.